are back today with another fan opening in Rocket League. Tons of tournament credits, a bunch of drops, and some black market trade-ups in there as well. So my man Jacob has lent me his account for this video today. You can check out his Twitch using the link in the description, along with my Twitch if you feel like checking it out. Leave a like if you're excited for this video and this series. If you have an account of a substantial size, I usually say about 300,000 tournament credits or more, maybe some drops and other trade-ups in there. Please do email me, get in touch, and maybe we can make a video together. I do have quite a lot of requests, but if you've got an account big enough, why not hit me up and see if we can get something going. Be sure to subscribe as we are getting very, very close to 900,000 subscribers, and I'm very excited to be here today. Yes, I've got the PlayStation shirt where the triangle is see-through because of the green screen. It's hilarious. <laughs> so yes, we're going to start with the drops. Then we'll go to the trade-ins, trade up anything from the drops if we get anything. Do three black market trade-ups. Some of them could be painted black markets. You never know. And then we're going to open about 22 All-Star Cups, I think, along with a Prospect Cup. And then do all the trade-ups for that as well. So it's going to be fun. Sit back, relax, enjoy. And we're going to get to the drops right now. Also, I did finally get in touch with the winner of the Titanium White Mainframe. Or they finally got back in touch with me. And I... I gave them the white mainframe, so uh, I will, if I remember in the editing, to put a clip over the screen now. Finally, this guy got back to me. It's been a long time. Let's get him in the trade. There you go. Bang. I was going to continue the video and put it in, but then I realized you wouldn't see the amazing luck that is this uncommon drop. But yes, they were very grateful. It's an uncommon, very rare. It's treasure. Ooh. Looking pretty, looking pretty fresh. Was that? <laughs> yeah, it was. I was, I was. I thought, was, is that a trophy coming out of the car? Really? Coins I get, but trophies, that is maybe a, perhaps a little bit excessive. Um, but here we go. Uncommon drops. Usually we don't get a lot. Ooh, I mean, <laughs> that's that's not the worst. Not the worst it could be. Um, usually we don't get a lot in the drops, but we, we ease ourselves into the video, into the luck, and then some sick stuff happens. I'm just off the back of uploading the Titanium White Atomic Blip on a fan account video. That was so, so sick. I was so happy for it. Hopefully, we can emulate that kind of luck today. And there were some comments on that video saying I traded up a happy holidays or something. I didn't go back to the video to check, but apparently that was worth like 300 to 400 credits, but I was under no specific instructions by whose account it was, the person whose account it was, to not trade that up. And I, I literally follow the instructions I'm giving to the letter to make the best content and and such and such. So they they had no specific you know requirement for me to not trade that up. So I'm guessing it wasn't that big of a deal to them. And to be honest, what's a few hundred credits between friends? Am I right? It's a libertine. I thought maybe we could have got a painted octane there, but it was in fact a libertine. So <laughs> I mean. Honestly, unless you're really into trading and you're you're wanting to make the maximum amount of profit, then that's not going to bother you. A happy holidays because he might not have even known he had it. It might have just been sat there otherwise, and he probably didn't mind too much. So I'm not going to lose sleep over it. So you guys, you don't have to worry. You don't have to point it out to me as if I've made some kind of massive sin or error. <laughs> it's all good. And let me know down in the comments why not. Have you got anything from the select? item favorite series. I don't know if I've got that order in, you know, the, the word order right in my head, but I, it's Monday morning whilst I'm recording this. As you guys know, my Thursday videos are filmed on a Monday morning, and over the weekend, I was away. I played cricket on Saturday as I always do, and then for Father's Day in the UK, I was at my grandma's house with, with my dad and, and other people in the family, and, you know, so I haven't been at the computer, I haven't been playing Rocket League, so I haven't got a single drop myself from the, the select favorite series. I haven't got any painted hellfires or anything like that. So let me know down in the comments what you've got. I have had a few emails, however, from you guys saying, hey, I got a, I think someone emailed me saying they got a saffron hellfire and wondered if I wanted to trade it or something like that. So, you know, let me know in the comments. Let me know down in the comments what stuff you've got from the new series. Maybe you've been unlucky and you've just got some clodhopper wheels because they're obviously with, with the new series comes rare items that you perhaps don't want to get. <laughs> so, uh, yeah, let me know. And we'll continue opening these rare drops. And then I think with 20 plus All-Star Cups, I'm hoping we get one black market uh, in the All-Star Cups. But if not, 22 very rares and above, you would like to think that's enough to get a black market trade up. I saw, if I remember correctly, there were two exotics from the tournament series that he already has to potentially get a black market from the tournament series. But also we're going to get three black markets anyway from the trade up. So Anodized Pearl, I do need to keep that. I need to keep Cristiano's if we get any and Painted Octane's and that's pretty much it. And then as far as uh, the tournaments go, all I need to keep are just a bunch of colored chromatic hollows. So white, black, 
crimson, sky blue, and purple. Those chromatic hollows, I need to keep those, but any chain helm sacreds, he doesn't care for, so I'm going to trade those up. It's going to be sick, and I'm very, very excited. So here we go. We're also getting close to the very rare drops where maybe I can finally break the duck of getting no good items in a drop in videos because <laughs> I've probably opened more drops collectively on all these different accounts more than anyone in the game because I've actually got access to many, many drops based on many seasons worth of challenges on accounts and I've never got anything good. I, I don't think I've ever got a painted octane or a painted standard. I mean, and the black sterns I got from the drop series was a trade up. So that was very, very lucky, but it wasn't in the drop. So hopefully the very rare drops can nice us. It would be great. I mean, imagine the scenes when I get a white octane from a drop because obviously, I mean, I, don't, I, I say I don't want to spoil it. It's up on the channel. We got a white octane very recently in a trade up. And whilst that's very, you know, very difficult, I guess it's, it's not likely. That was great. I've done that many, many times at this point. Imagine this, the day where I open, you know, a rare drop or a very rare drop or even an import drop. It's a bit of a shortcut, but even that and get a titanium white octane. I'm asking for a lot, maybe just a painted octane to start with. But imagine the scenes when we get that. That would be a happy day. So hopefully... Binary, okay, not great, but even the bare minimum of this crate, a very rare, is good trade-up material. And with five or six, we'll probably get enough trade-ups to do potentially a painted octane trade-up if all else fails. And if that fails, we have all star cups. So here we go. It's an exotic drop. Oh, my colorblind eyes thought I just got black creepers, but you can't. I guess you can't. That means you probably can't get painted exotics in these drops because you can't get drop exotics that are painted. I think that's probably how it works. But anyway, we've got two more to go. Two more chances at the white octane. Again, here we go. Could be it. Pixel fire. Okay, I'll take it. I'll take I'll take a bit of pixel fire. Pixel fire for the pick. We don't mind it. Come on, next one. Another import. It's an endo. Okay. Eh, well, it's not bad. So now we're going to do the trade-ins. And we'll start with the uncommons. Yeah, they can all go. We got them all today. Get them gone. Brushed metal. Not bad. Not bad. We'll trade them all. We'll keep the Fennec Edge Burst just in case he wants to keep that. Unless I need to trade it up. Uh, Neoctane's kind of cool as well. Plasma, you're gone. Merc Warlock. Okay. We'll go with you, you. Proteus Wheels, Zeta Wheels, and Sandstorm. That's what we'll do. And we'll keep the rest. Metallic Pearl. Now we have two chances. Going to keep that at the White Octane. Bubbles. <laughs> the, 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 it's so weird what you, what you can and can't get. Here we go. One more. Jaeger. Okay. Now we got one more trade up to do. We'll keep the cars, I think. Yeah, we'll keep the cars. Why not? Hikari P5. So there we go. We can keep... Uh, we'll keep his white Gurnots uh, because why not? And then we'll keep uh, the Creepers, I guess. So let's do a, a crate only trade up. We'll do Egg 19, Gift 19... GIF 19. Trying to see if we can do uh, one that can get a painted mainframe only. Yeah, we'll do that. Uh, we'll take off the pumpkin 20 and do the GIF 20. No, we'll do the egg 19. There we go. So this could be a painted black market. Come on. Oh, it is. Grey 20XX. I'll take that, you know. Painted black market. Not bad. Now we'll see if we can get as many of these as possible. Egg. Oh, it's an egg 19. We'll do GIF 20. We'll keep the white gurnot. So this is... I think this is all golden crate exotics as well. Nah, it's a Stormwatch. Can't be painted. We'll go with this, 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 and this. This is just a drop one. Let's see what we can get. Singularity. Okay, nothing crazy, but there we go. And now we have the beautiful job of doing Tournament Wars. Let's just see the black markets we've got here. So, Hades Bomb and Nurgle, Season 2 completed, and Digiglow from Season 1. Then we have the Grey 20XX we just got, the Singularity and Stormwatch. So, no Discoid or Atomic Blip. I love it. You love to see it. And also, if you do want to support the channel, feel free to use Code Pixel Army. I wonder if Jacob's using Code Pixel Army. He is! Let's go! Been using it for a week, and there's an orange Electroshock in the... Ooh! Oh, I need to get that when I go back on my account. So there we go. Thank you for using Code Pixel Army, all of you. I really do appreciate it. Now, we're going to open the tournament rewards. We're going to start with a Prospect Cup. Uh, okay. And now I'm trying to think. So it's 240,000, 264,000. We can open one more. Okay. <laughs> Here we go. 22 All-Star Cups, baby. Be big. Oh. What the heck? They've updated the artwork. I mean, I have to say that is much cooler looking than whatever they had before. It was so uninspiring before that I can't remember it, but that looks quite cool. Uh, we've got a Grievance Inverted. We're going to do a Nose Crate. Bang. Oh, regular Chromatic Hollow. We'll keep that. Now Beard Crate. Come on. Ah, Sky Blue Grievance. We're going to keep that. No worries. Now we're going to do the, uh, the much successful in recent times No Reaction Cup. Moving on. 
Grievance again. All-star cups, don't be doing this to me. That's three very rares in a row, at least, I think. Okay, Chain Helm Sacred, that's good for trade-ups. We are definitely going to get a tournament black market now by this point because we've got enough items to do so. So this is exciting. I'm happy with this. We've still got 12 more to go. Grey Chain Helm Sacred. Probably going to trade that up, but I'll keep it if we don't, you know, if we, unless we need to trade it up, then I won't. But, oh, okay. First black market. I told you I wanted one from this many all-star cups and we got the Discoid. So if we could maybe, I mean, if it's asking a lot, but if we could get an Atomic Blip as well, and complete the black market set that would be great if not we'll leave it to the trade-ups a fair few grievance wheels i'm seeing but we're definitely oh my days yes another black market and it's a painted discoid this time and there's a chromatic hollow we need an atomic blip oh my gosh yes we've done it we've got both non-painted and a painted and it's scorer as well He's got, I think he, the painted, uh, not the painted, the non-painted Digiglobe he uses is certified. And that's clearly what he's been using. Fantastic goalkeeper. He might prefer the scorer atomic blip. We've got the saffron discoid and the discoid. This is huge. This is absolutely massive. Oh, back to back atomic blip. <laughs> yes. Let's go. Let me check. It, it definitely was back to back atomic blip, right? It was back to back atomic blip. Surely not again. Three in a row? Oh, I imagine. Oh, my days. Chromatic Hollow Cobalt. Not one we have to keep. So that's ideal for trade-ups. Back-to-back Atomic Blip. You love to see it. Let's get rid of these player anthems. Ooh, Titanium White Striker. <laughs> what? That's crazy. I will probably keep those if I, if I need to. You know what I mean? Because that's quite cool. It's quite cool. Here we go. So we're going to go you, you... You and you. So, yeah, we'll keep the white striker grievance. That's ideal. Okay, chromatic hollow. Here we go. One black market. We can keep all of the all of the painted stuff. You know, cobalt. We'll keep the turtle. We'll keep the grey chain helm sacred. So, we've got two atomic blips. Two discoids, one painted. So, I guess atomic blip painted would be ideal. Okay. Here we go. Come on. Ah, oh, it's a regular discoid. But, I mean... Five black markets with 22 all-star cups. That is an absolute win. And we're one exotic away from another black market for him. So we went from three black markets to 11. That's eight black markets in one video. That is absolutely insane. Two painted ones, one certified one. We got Titanium White Striker as well. A few painted exotics, Grey Chain Helm Sacred, Cobalt Chromatic Hollow, both of which we've kept. I think that is a win. That is a huge win for the boys and girls, of course. I am shocked by that. Eight black markets. I don't know how I'm going to title this back-to-back -back atomic blip. Most black markets in a tournament opening. I have no idea, but that is a win. If you did enjoy this video, please do drop a like on it. Thank you, Jacob, for allowing me to give my luck to your account. Like I said at the beginning of the video, you guys can check him out in the description. His Twitch will be linked down there as well as mine and all my other social medias. Leave a like if you enjoyed. Subscribe as well to join the Pixel Army. I have been Pixel. You have been awesome. And I'll see you in the next video very soon. I went really low there at the end, didn't I? Like a, like a TV presenter. Very soon.